Hi everyone, it's Tuesday, December 22nd, and here's what's making headlines. Yesterday's rally has extended into the open. Investors are seeing green arrows across the board in early going. Revised government data has confirmed that the U.S. economy returned to growth in the third quarter. However, the expansion was not as large as economists had previously thought. Revised GDP statistics showed 2.2 percent growth in the quarter. OPEC will keep output unchanged as decided at their meeting in Angola. This is the fourth time this year that the group has kept output steady. Take-Two is sinking 1.5%. The video game maker cut its full-year forecast and announced plans to sell its distribution business. And Jabal Circuits is soaring 7% after swinging to a profit in the first quarter. This compared to a net loss last year when a write-down hurt results. Let's see what all of this means for the market. The Dow is rising 18 points or two-tenths of a percent. The Nasdaq is also gaining two-tenths of a percent. Meanwhile, the S&P is up more than one-tenth of a percent. Take a look at the commodities and currencies markets, crude oil and gold are both slipping and early going. On the currency front, the U.S. dollar is falling against the euro but rising against the yen. Heading overseas, Asian markets were mostly higher on Tuesday as Japan surged nearly 200 points and Hong Kong added more than 140 points. The European markets are gaining in midday. The U.K. is leading the way higher, rising nine-tenths of a percent. That's what's happening at the Open for Tuesday, December 22nd. I'm Deborah Ruther. Be sure to stay logged on to RTTnews.com for continuing updates throughout the day.